hey guys welcome back to my channel ag motion designs and in today's video we are going to create this elegant title animation inside of after effects without using any plugin so without wasting any more time let's get started So here we are in after effects now let's create a new composition I'll call it as main animation width is 1920 and height should be like this now select this keyframes hit f9 go to the graph editor select this graph editor and by holding shift adjust this graph editor just like this so our animation will look like this move this keyframe over here Now if you want then we can add one property known as opacity and make it zero. So it will look like this. After this move to these keyframes and add another animator. Go to the add property and create tracking. and make it let's say 26 7 so the animation will look like this or you can make it minus 50 so it will look like this now press s for scaling options create one keyframe over here go to the two seconds and let's make it 250 select these keyframes hit f9 Open the graph editor, select this graph and again adjust this handle. Let's make it 10. I'll move this over here. Select these keyframes and hit F9. Again, hit F9. So it will look like this. Select these keyframes, hit F9. 
go to the graph editor select this graph and just adjust these handles just like this so our animation will look something like this now we will create our another text called as designs control alt home align it horizontally and then align it vertically hit u go to this here and move the sticks little bit upward just like this go to this animation property and select tracking and I increase the tracking distance something like this hit you to deselect it and for this text I will go to the character I will delete this fill and only thing I use is stroke and stroke should be 2 now what I will do is I will go to this motion text text animate 1 hit ctrl c choose this layer move this layer over here by simply hitting opening bracket and press ctrl v if you hit u on keyboard as you can see our animation will look something move it a little bit over here so as you can see our animation will look like this now if you want then you can change the color of this text just like this same for here also choose something like this hit ok you can increase the font size again stroke width let's say 4 now select this layers hit ctrl shift c i'll call it as text 1 just like this I create one mask for now I'll choose rectangle tool I don't want stroke over here I'll delete the stroke I'll create one mask over here it's control alt home and in track mat then I'll choose alpha mat and what I'll do is after this animation as you can see it's quite disturbing so what i'll do is i press s for scaling option unlink this option and just increase the size now hit p on position create one keyframe over here go to something like this okay delete this keyframe create one keyframe over here and one keyframe over here and move this mask something like this select this layer and hit F9 open the graph editor select this graph and adjust these handles something like this now I'll unhide this now I'll create one stroke by using pen tool. I don't want any fill over here. I'll just create one stroke. <coughs> the stroke width should be 10. Here is control alt home and parent this stroke with this mask means shape layer. 
hide this shape layer. Now what I'll do is I'll animate the scaling property of this stroke. Hit S for scaling option. Unlink this option. Create one keyframe over here and one keyframe over here. And instead of 100, I'll choose zero. And sorry, instead of 100, I'll choose zero over here. Over here is 100. Now select this keyframes. Hit F9. Go to the graph editor. Select this graph editor and just adjust this handles like this so it will look something like this now i'll import my logo over here This is my logo. I'll hit Ctrl C. You can choose whatever logo you want. For now, I'll choose my logo only. I'll move it over here. This S for scaling options. Not something like this. Move it a little bit over here at the center. Now I'll duplicate this shape layer. And drag it a little bit down and drag. I'll drag my logo over here. And instead of alpha mat, I'll choose alpha inverted mat. So our animation will look something like this. Now press S for scaling options. Select this keyframes. Hit Ctrl C, hit Ctrl V. Right click on this keyframe, keyframe assistant and time reverse keyframes just like this. So this is our simple text animation inside of After Effects. <coughs> now there is another thing you can do if you want. Just select this text, go to the transform property, type transform. You can create a skew, something like this. Skew axis is minus 90, skew is 6. So it will look something like this. It depends on you. I think this looks also good. You can choose whatever scale you want. For now, I will choose something like this. Also, if you want a little bit extra animation all you need to do is hit ctrl d on the stroke two times for the first time i'll choose stroke with 8 and color i'll take this blue color for the second one i'll choose red color and stroke width should be let's say for here we should take 8 and then for this one i'll choose 5 hit ok What we will do is we will just adjust this layer something like this. So this is our final animation. tutorial then please consider to subscribe my channel until then stay tuned